In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the passive lumbar extension test for radiographic instability of the lumbar spine. Hi and welcome back to Physio Tudors. As you might know, non-specific low back pain patients are very heterogeneous. It is thus necessary to classify them in order to provide adequate treatment. In the case of lumbar instability, the best available diagnostic value is a cluster of subjective and objective findings, which we discussed in another video. Nonetheless, there are also physical tests which can give an indication for lumbar spine instability, one of which is the passive lumbar extension test, or PLAT. According to Kazai et al. in 2006, it has a reported sensitivity of 84.2% and a specificity of 90.4%. For the test, the patient lies in prone position. Then, both legs are passively uh, raised about 30 centimeters from the bench and then pulled gently. If the patient experiences severe low back pain or if there is a feeling of heaviness on the lower back or a feeling as though the lower back were about to come off, the test is considered positive. Be aware that radiographic imaging should not necessarily be considered the gold standard to diagnose instability, as the findings, as we know, are often deceiving, with patients not having any correlating symptoms. Okay, I would definitely advise you to watch our playlist on lumbar spine instability by clicking or tapping on the left and make sure to subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet. Check the links in the video description down below if you want to support us or if you want to follow us on various social media. As always, this was Andreas for Physio Tudors. I'll see you next time. Bye.